in this video I am going to discuss about how to display first enrows, last enrows in Alteryx. So add here this is the Alteryx Designer 64 bit operating system for. So add here I want to display first enrows or last enrows. So first I am going to drag input data inside the workflow and here you can use the file or database so here i'm going to use the oracle database so how to connect oracle with Alteryx that i already discussed and here going to uh, take uh, uh, hr schema and uh, going to use employee employees table and here double click on the employees table now here after select first one so by uh, selecting this you can select all the columns so this all columns are there so after or uh, doing this let's uh, click ok and here after here this is the table query or a database it's come there and uh, here after or to display first uh, end rows or last end rows we need to go at uh, here if I select uh, this one so this is award create update column using one or more and here this is the limit or uh, limit to like uh, let's track this one first and here you can uh, see or uh, you can uh, select a sample data so by using samples so by default radio button it's selected so that display first end rows now first we need to stabilize the link and here let's use the report text and track this link into the report text and here uh, so this is about the uh, oracle tables and here this is sample data tool now here by default it's selected first end rows so in incoming uh, that so incoming if i give at here at this place 10 so that will display first 10 rows so here let's execute the workflow now here so i'm going to go on at here oracle and here you can see 107 record display and here you can see employee id it's so uh, start from 100 it's all in sequence and uh, or till 10 rows the value is now 109 now if i click at here sample tool so here you can see in the sample tool so uh, sample tool here so this is the same thing now if i select this part so here uh, when that come or uh, this place so that to the filter after doing the filter that load into the load the record into add here this no text enter so after when that come at this place here doing or uh, displaying 10 rows the value is start from 100 and uh, that go 109 okay now here if you want to display last end rows so here if i go scroll down here the last end rows add here total numbers of rows 107 and here i want to display last five rows okay last five rows i want to display so here you can count so one two three four so that is start from this so at here one two three four five so the value that is start from or two zero two that end with two zero six now here after let's go at this place uh, first and here uh, give last uh, end rows and in place of uh, uh, 10 i am giving 5 now here if you execute so here you can see 5 last 5 
and uh, here this is the incoming record so that's uh, here that uh, should be displayed to zero or uh, start from at here or uh, 202 and uh, here you can see 202 and that in with 206 so 1 2 3 4 5 5 records it's a uh, displaying so Altrix has the very nice features by using uh, this uh, sample or tool you can easily filter out uh, the values now here uh, if you want to escape the uh, five rows okay so here if you don't want this uh, from there okay so you can use escape first uh, n rows now since I check this and here the condition here given n equal to 5 so first 5 rows that escape so here this is now if I click there so that is start from 105 here you can see after escaping 5 that is start from 105 like this one of every n rows so here let's give uh, values 10 and if I execute now here you can see one of every 10 so here that value start from 100 now here first that display 100 now after 10 so 110 10 that remove 10 again 20 30 like this that displaying like this here after one in n chance including each row so if i execute so here you can see this is the incoming and after doing the filtering here you can see of uh, uh, that uh, start with uh, 100 and after that 102 and here 124 so about this one here one in n chances to include each row now if you want to do the filter uh, mod operator so n value is now 10 and uh, here rows so 10 mod 1 so it divide by 10 times and remainder come 0 so modulus operator that return the remainder so here the value is displaying uh, uh, here this is the incoming and here the value is so displaying 10 100 and that go till 110 and after that uh, that not satisfy the condition so that here it's not displaying the values so this is the way we can display first n rows last n rows in all tricks so i hope guys this video is helpful for you so now in this video it's over so thanks for watching see you next video thank you